Hello guys, welcome back to another episode. It's been a couple days. I have not had time to play. Been uh been a very busy weekend. Um and I am actually about to leave my house to go uh to the London thing that we talked about for uh the coastal or not coastal. <laughs> I've already forgot the name of the game. Um Planet, uh, planet coaster, not coastal, nothing. Um, so we're gonna continue on with our search here. It is horde day though, so I've picked a bad day. It's uh, it's Monday. Um, I'm about to leave. I I literally have like 20 minutes, 30 minutes tops to record a quick episode here before I jump out of my seat into a car and go to the airport. Um. I was just checking my flight. Delta has upgraded me to first class um, on the domestic legs of the flight. So not for um, the long part, unfortunately. Uh, so I have a layover in Boston. And uh, from here to Boston, I'll, I'll be in first class. But then from Boston to London, I will not. That's still better than nothing. That's why you should all fly Delta. This is not a paid ad. They should pay me to advertise, though. They really should. Delta. I know you're watching Delta. You can pay me now. <laughs> uh, so, uh, I I got a couple comments um, about me spending so much time scrapping stuff. Because, I mean, I do spend a lot of time in my inventory scrapping stuff. And it ends up consuming a big portion of the episodes. And so I can understand how that could get um, annoying. Oh, I think we found a city. We did. We just stored up on a city. Hi. Bye. Um, is that a cop? Is that a cop? You a cop? Start, don't hunt me. I think it is a cop. It's a cop. I missed. I missed the cop. What is that? What is that right there? Don't puke on me. Who's he shooting at? Are you, well, he didn't shoot nobody, but who's he hitting at? Take those. Well, I have a magnum now, don't I? I think I do. Alright, what what am I seeing over here? It's just a weird terrain generation, I guess. Um, alright, so I think we're somewhere we've never been, right? Yeah, we definitely are. Okay. So what do we got here? We got a city. You could tell when the when the the, the world started changing a little bit um, that we were about to roll up in the city. Um, so anyways, back to what I was saying here. I, uh, I think it's pretty understandable. Um, especially if you watched if you watched my single player, you probably got accustomed to heavy heavily edited um, Seven Days to Die footage. Because I, uh, I was editing my stuff, you know, cutting out a lot of the a lot of the looting, a lot of the scrapping. Um, and I guess what changed in the big picture of it all is that I started treating, you know, at that time I was still doing, um, vanilla Minecraft content, so I was, um, you know, in between these episodes, I still had kind of my, my, my vlog, or vlog, uh, content, and since then I've been treating this as such, um, so I haven't really had another outlet to uh, to ramble about stuff um, that I've always used you know that like that content for and so you know this kind of became that content and I guess as a result I stopped heavily editing this this stuff so much um, but that all said I don't disagree with what uh, with the comment I do think that I could probably do a better job of of cutting some stuff, um, editing the footage in a way that is more entertaining and more to the point. Um, it would require me to ramble a little less, probably. Um, which, you know, it's it's, uh, it's a thing where people are here for different reasons, of course. You know, some people are here for this certain type of co content, and others want something different. You know, it's, it is what it is. Okay, so someone's definitely been here before. I'm gonna I'm gonna guess badge. I always like to guess badge, because for one thing, it kind of pisses him off. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get to see badge uh, t tomorrow. Um, 
So my uh, my flight leaves here uh, at five in the afternoon, and I land there at seven in the morning. Is this another one of those shitty shitty towns? Uh, it is. Another shitty town. She part town. Whole town she town. She town. Town so shitty. It is. There's no she town. Um. Don't there's anything good in this whole town. Probably not. She town. This is not one of those uh, collapsed buildings. She town. Um. It's a screamer. There's all these Zistos around this town. Zisto town. A lot of zombies in town. It's probably because it's partially because it's day 35. Um, yeah, I land there at seven in the morning, and uh, look at all these zombies, man. How many bullets do I have? Not a lot. Even less of these. I had a feeling something was coming up behind me. Um, and then, uh, supposed to have cake and coffee uh, with the, the developers of this game at uh, the hotel. And then uh, go play the game, meet the developers. Oh, oh, oh. Lame. I think I have some honey. I think I kept some honey just just for that occasion. Didn't I? Yeah, I did. Can't eat it though, cause I'm all filled up. Um. Uh. So that, then I was supposed to play the game at two, and uh, then we're supposed to have. I was supposed to go over to the YouTube offices there in um in London, and then go to dinner, and then go to sleep, and then at eight o'clock in the morning I get on the plane and come home. <laughs> so uh it's it's really short lived. Um and uh the timing's kind of unfortunate. Hey look it's wasteland. We haven't seen wasteland in forever. Remember when we used to live in the wasteland? Remember how much it sucked? Pepperidge Farm remembers. Um So um so it's last weekend this whole weekend, man, this weekend's been the worst. Um so my daughter had her first camping trip, which I had to miss because of Minecraft-related stuff. We had uh, some stuff going on this weekend that kept me pretty busy, um, which was I was I was uh, I wasn't happy about th that. Um, you know, wanted to, to definitely be there for that, but um, sometimes you just have to do certain things for for, for your job, I guess. Uh, I generally try to do family first, um, but you know, it wasn't the end of the world. It was pretty much the end of the world. Um, <laughs> not really. Um, but, uh, you know, helped them set up the... Uh, in fact, we cut our agrarian skies uh, short this week. We have enough content. I mean, it's not like I'm, I'm not saying this in a way that you're going to miss episodes. Um, but uh, that's one series that we tend to record well in advance if we can. Um, so, and we are right now. We're, we're, we're ahead. Um, so, anyways, cut it short so I can help set up the tent and all that stuff. Um... But, uh, then I had to come home. Oh, I see a cop. <laughs> Boo. Um, what are these? These are, these are new buildings to me. So, uh, then the following morning is when things got really lame. Uh, you know, my grandma broke her, her left hip not too long ago. Um, well, it's been, it's been over a year now, um, since then, but, uh, you guys are so slow. Like, did you, did you come in here and die? Um, but, uh, fast forward to Saturday morning, 8 a.m., get a phone call from her. She has fallen and broken her right hip. Um, so, I went up there and, um... Called the ambulance to come and take her to 
the hospital. Um, you know, weren't sure. It's one of those things where you're not, you're not sure at first if, if it's broken or what. Um, so called the ambulance and they came out and have, you know, took her to the hospital and confirmed that it was in fact broken. So um, she has broken her, her other hip. You know, a matching pair of broken hips now. Um, so the shitty part was, I guess, no surgeons work on the weekends. So they were like, well, all right, lay here with your broken hip until uh, Monday. <laughs> So she's having surgery like right now as we speak actually. Um, to be a real boy again. <laughs> a real girl. So hopefully she'll be okay. Um, they always say it's one of those things where like once you break a hip you're fucked for life kind of thing. But you know she, she recovered just fine from the other hip she broke. So I don't know. I think she... I don't know. She's uh, she's had breast cancer twice and been fine. You know, I mean, she's she's worried about having surgery, of course. But it just, uh, I guess the the reason why the timing sucks is because I'm leaving today while she's having surgery to go to London. But I'll only be gone a day, so um, it's not it's not the end of the world. My uh, my daughter's kind of freaking out. I I guess she, you know, she she was alive whenever um. My girl broke her first tip, but she was too young, I guess, to really realize what was going on. And, uh, man, I still can't eat. Get hungry, man. Get hungry. You got it. You're, you're infected, buddy. Um, so, yeah, she, uh, she wasn't old enough to really know what was going on, but now she is, and she's just like, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm just going to have surgery. I'm scared. That, and, uh, I think her pee bag's probably really full now. She's, like, all about this pee bag. I don't know why I'm ever looking in those anymore. There's never anything of importance in there. And these sports bags are never going to contain uh, the auger parts that we need. We're never going to find auger, man. I don't even know what I'm looking for in this place. We did make a magnum, right? What was the thing? Yeah, okay, what's... The parts are what's shitty. Can there be auger stuff in file cabinets, you think? Like, I need to find... It's a refrigerator upstairs. Screw it. What is this place? This is a place that got beat up by zombies, what it is. I know cars can have them. So I'll keep searching all the cars. But I have decided that um, I, I got to stop recording on the weekends. There's just too much going on. Um, we're always trying to make family plans on the weekends, and I'll, and you know I, I don't ever schedule any. Um, Recur reoccurring group content on the weekends, but I've decided I'm just gonna full on no more weekend content of any type, and so I probably will miss some group events. But um, like it's only a year out before my daughter starts school, and um, you know we're trying to do as much as we can, go to the beach, go to the mountains, that type of stuff um, before before she starts school. So. Um, so I think I'm gonna, I might miss some group stuff in the future, but I think it's, uh, it's a fair trade, um, and hopefully we can schedule a lot of the, the stuff on, on weekdays as we have for the most part already. This this place has not been fantastic. It's not been a complete waste of time. I'm gonna go through this this car park here because I, again I think. Okay, wait, wait, wait. First, let's go build this thing, because a lot of times there is garage storage in these, and that's what we need to find auger stuff. Or possible to find auger stuff. The cars are just empty. Just empty. I, uh... Oh, these are just regular cardboard boxes. I thought there was garage ones in here. Um, 
I meant to get more of this stuff recorded, um, but I spent literally all day yesterday at, uh, at the hospital. Man, I just, I'm not a hungry guy. I'm not, I'm not hungry. Um, am I thirsty? I am thirsty. I'm a thirsty man. Okay, I'm not thirsty anymore. Uh. That's good. These cupboards can have uh, anything good in them. Oh, come on. We are in a garage. I've never seen anything but clothes in the lockers. I don't think the, the lockers will take anything but clothes. Take it, I said. You guys keep mentioning that um, that Anders now has a second auger. Fuck that guy. <laughs> uh, I'm jealous of his second auger. I really am. But uh, hopefully, hopefully I don't need it. Hopefully I can come home a man with his head held high. A man that accomplished his goals. A man that salt off into the world. Salt off? Um, into the world and came back. In fact, a boy that was sought off. I don't know why I'm saying sought off. Uh, into the world and came back a man. Um, hopefully, that is that is where this all ends. I refuse to uh, let Anders just hand me my manhood. Well, that thing really wanted to spawn a headlight. Come on. You can do this. You can do this. Be garage. We're in a garage. This is not a, this is this is bullshit. Wonder uh what's on the loot table for this thing? Apparently coffee beans. I'm all subconscious about scrapping anything. And so there's going to be a camp of people that are like the scrappers. <laughs> Scrappy dappy doo. Um, but for real, there's going to be there's going to be a camp of scrappers that are like freaking out now because I'm not scrapping stuff. So there's been no resolution. I'm going to go back to scrapping stuff. I'm just going to uh, go start cutting my footage down. Um, to, to cut that stuff out, which is what I want to do anyways. It's just a matter of having the time to do that stuff. Um, so yeah. It's really weird how the floor doesn't want to be. Be, be, floor. I'm risking life and limb to come up here and check for the stuff that we need. <gasps> Okay, we survived. We made it. Let's get out of here. There was no auger stuff here. Whoever thought there would be was a fool. I'm getting really lucky here on day 35 to not be overrun by uh, hordes. I should be in a town. The doc was on earlier. I wonder how his experience was. Let's pause his name right now. Boy Beater 3000. I guess he's been playing the calling. I've heard good things about that game. I have not had a chance to check it out yet, though. Doc was talking about it. I bought it. Oh come on! I don't want. I don't want your in my face, asshole. Okay, you're dead, right? I thought you were dead, you motherfucker. That's some bullshit. Can I eat the shit, motherfucker, man? Just can't. I'm just not allowed. Alright, get rid of this. Give me that. 
Where is this burning bitch? Oh, there you are. Couldn't see you. Couldn't see you there. I thought there was actually a, a thing in there. A, uh, a thing. <laughs> a flashlight. I just don't know where to even look, man. This place sucks. I don't think there's anything of value in this town. It's a sad town. Where sad people go to be sad. Sad town. That was empty. Can you not read? Oops. I don't know if there's anything. I don't know what this building is. buildings where sad people work in sad town. Alright, fuck this building. I hate it. Sad town. There's the gas station. What is this? Why is that? Why does that be? Alright, if I look at this whole place. No, I have not. So I'm going to go over to this side. So, um, you know, you guys know we've talked to talk quite a bit about surviving Minecraft Island. Um, and you know, I've said the plan is that uh, Jeff and I and uh, contestants and other Minecrafters, cameraman, whatever, uh, plan on doing uh, the, the recap, uh, similar to what we did for Survivor back in the day, me and Jeff did, um, Jeff and I. And uh, so the first one should come out this Wednesday was the plan, um, and Jeff and I were going to record it this weekend, but I haven't been home all weekend. Um, so we was just recorded yesterday, Sunday, and I was at the hospital until like nine o'clock at night last night. Um, so that did not happen, and I don't know what the plan is now because we want to release it on Wednesday because um, on Thursdays we have the podcast, and on Fridays will be the next episode. So the plan was to release them on every Wednesday, and. Uh, we're failing the first one already uh, because of timing here. I don't know. Jeff's gonna try to see if because uh, Beef's one of the people that said he wanted to he wanted to be a part of it too. Um, so Jeff was gonna see if Beef's available, um, but Jeff didn't want to do the first one without me. Um, I mean, because I you know I want to be there for all of them honestly, but uh, definitely didn't want to start off the whole thing without me. What the fuck are you? Oh God, why you not have sound? bitch. You know what? Can I not be infected anymore? Am I allowed to eat this honey? I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try again. I can do it now. I finally can do it, guys. Mmm, honey. Honey nut Cheerios. Hey, now. Listen. Oh, oh, he hit me. Oh, I'm bleeding. Um. I think I see a cop over there. I do see a cop over here. He hates this car more than anything else.
Um, so yeah, we'll see what happens. Uh, but one of our possible solutions we were talking about was doing the first two weeks, so not having a recap the first week, which would be unfortunate. Um, but not having a recap the first week and then having two on the second week. Um, or not two, but having two weeks in one. So we'll see. The response has been really good. Uh, you know, I was, I was worried because it's been so long. And it's also one of those things where, you know, I don't know how to describe it. You get super invested in something. And, like, I basically gave it away to some degree. Not, like, I didn't give it away, but, like, my involvement got a lot less there towards the end by giving the production to broadband. Um, so, I don't know, it, it feels weird when it does finally come out now. It's like, I'm not as excited as I would have been if it, obviously, if it would have come out, you know, years ago, for one thing. But just even if I had, like done all the editing myself and everything I think I would be more hyped about it all not that I'm not hyped but I'm not as hyped as I could have been I guess is the way I'm say, trying to say it or whatever I don't know if this is coming out correctly uh, what's the durability on this 180 okay not as much higher this place does not have auger parts man just want, just want the auger. You know, it's kind of funny because I'm tr the whole point of needing this auger and wanting this is because of how slow m mining is and getting the stone I need to make the concrete and stuff. But in the time I've spent looking for the auger, I probably could have mined out 12 cities. Um, and, uh, you know fine <laughs> had all the stone in the world not all of it in the whole world but a lot of it these don't have anything of importance right I remember cutting this other one and then breaking it down some. Okay. That's not a complete waste. I, I, I thought for sure no one had been up here. But I was wrong. So when the game does update to Alpha 14, I'm curious what your guys' opinions are now on um, the prefab stuff. Because we've done, you know, basically a season now, so to speak, with uh, with prefabs. Um, and I know when we first started out, everyone was really excited about it. You know, not just us, but, you know, the viewers, you guys, uh, were all really excited about just seeing new stuff that you don't normally see whenever you play the game or whatever, or, you know, just watching us play. But I'm curious, now that we've done it for a while, how people feel. I think I still would prefer the prefabs. Uh, there are times whenever I miss... What's the down there? Um... There are times whenever I miss the just the being able to go to a working stiff or whatever. But I think overall, this is better. Gives you more variety, more stuff to look at. Like this right here, like, I'm like, where, where am I? What have I found, you know? I think I haven't found nothing of importance here. It looks like where all the poop goes. I found where the poop goes. Now, if this was last season when I was collecting the turds, <laughs> I'd be really excited right now. 
Oh, my light was already on. I mean, there's duffel bags down here, but they can't have auger parts in them. How do you get... Okay, so let's see how you get up there. I think this is basically... Well, this is a sewer, but... I think it connects up with, like, a subway or something. I think we can just walk out of here, basically. I think. I don't actually know. It's very large. This is not, this is like, uh, this really is like a sewer. Could not get off of there. So how the hell do I get out of here? This is my life now. This man, he came here the same as me, and he's still here. I feel like I'm going in a circle. Probably have. Oh, they brought a whole toilet down here. Oh man, they each had their own toilet even. Oh, and that one left some poo in there. Oh hey, the magnum parts. One nine mil okay. Yes, everything here was good. You were you were a good man. You left me your poo and um better magnum parts. Now I wish I'd grab those magnum bullets earlier. You think any of these would lead out? I mean, I guess it kind of let out, like it led up to the surface, right? And I could like break out from there. Alright, I guess I'm going to go out the same way I came in. But I'm probably going to end this episode here, actually. I need to go, um, I have to leave the house here in about 20 more minutes. I need to make sure I got all my stuff together. Uh, start this video uploading so that I can schedule it once I get to London. Or release it once I get to London. Um, so this is the only episode I have until I get back on Wednesday. I get back at a decent time on Wednesday. It's like uh, 6 o'clock in the afternoon or so. So I should be able to resume recording and so on as long as like... Like this morning I was going to get up and record a bunch. So yeah, here's where I came out a minute ago. Um, and power goes out. And uh, you know, you guys know I have a generator or whatever. But I don't like, I don't like uh, using my computer too much on generator power. I have a UPS set up with my computer. But um, the power is not quite clean enough that it doesn't make my UPS fluctuate. Um, so it switches between charging and not charging, basically. Um, so I tend to not use my computer because it pulls even more power when I'm using it uh, from the UPS. So basically, whenever I'm on generator power, I, I, I tend to not record anything just because of how it all works. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Um, I got Life in the Woods recorded up, a Green Skies. Um, I'm going to miss Mario Kart tomorrow. Uh, so whatever Mario Kart we recorded last week, that's all I have until um, I get back. So, and we're back around to here. Uh, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end this episode here with my, my, my two best friends and my two new toilets. And um, thank you guys. I will, uh, I'll try to do a vlog, I don't know, I'm not, I'm probably not going to buy a SIM card, just I'm only going to be there one day, so, um, if I have Wi-Fi, I guess, uh, I can upload a vlog, I don't know, we'll see, um, but, uh, thanks guys, and I'll see ya pretty soon, bye-bye everybody.